Well, Doyle just looks like he's having a good time. He does. He really does. Uh, right. 2600. And he, his whole demeanor and, and countenance changes when he does smile. It's such a huge smile. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's amazing to watch. Please hold. Please hold. Okay. It's just an amazing accomplishment at that age to be starting a tournament that could last seven or eight days. If he and runs well, this oh, is a big, big endeavor. That's been his concern. Absolutely. Oh. JJ just calling, and Doyle comes along too. Good player. Ooh, two spades for Doyle. And Doyle last cash to the main event at age 80. Check. Uh, 2013. Check. Finished 409th. 4100. Yeah, mean following up with his original raise that he's going to be met with a flush draw and top pair. There's oh. top pair coming along. And that flush draw for Doyle. JJ still best. Check. Eight's now picking up a gutter ball. Let's see if he wants to continue with this ruse. Doyle with a pair to go with his nut flush draw. Somewhat short stack though. 16,000. Doyle's gonna wow. bet on the come. I mean, can't feel good about his eights anymore. <laughs> I think we're just to uh, Hollywood in a little before hitting the muck. And FYI, masks do not cover up your tells, okay? <laughs> 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 it's like a little nervous under there, but reaching for chips? Wow. Really? I mean, uh, it doesn't put anybody on an ace, if, I guess, if he's coming along, but maybe it is just a little. Wow, I'm really oh. surprised at this call. You gotta look at Brunson stack and know that he's not folding this hand. Um, very, very unlikely to fold this hand at any point. Got Let's rid see of here, JJ. maybe a brick on the river, but oh, no. Doyle hits his flush on the end. Also giving eights a straight. This is an amazing card for Doyle. He should get that last 13k paid off. Fifty-two in the middle. I wonder how much of this can I get him to pay off? <laughs> yeah, I mean, as Jamie mentioned, hit it straight with that third spade on board. 13 eight. All in. And All a call. In. There's the straight. There's the flush. Doyle with the double up. Let's go. <laughs> Doyle Brunson, over 80,000. Door like he's, he's, he's been here before. Tickets <laughs> <laughs> went on, but oh, yeah, we have uh, yeah. top ten school for poker in the country. So pretty unconventional to have limped with tens and then Doyle just calls the behind with Ace good. King, mm. playing the smallest pot possible with these hands. Look at all the clubs out there. Well, the tens oh, only yeah. made hand right now, and there's another club. Ace of clubs. Uh, 1,000. Doyle. Catching the flop. And I uh, mean, donking out with four deuce suited. He's got bottom pair, some backdoor possibilities. I guess just hopeful that since it's a limp pot that no one has an ace. Call. Call. Thousand from each. We play you. <laughs> Check. Check. Doyle's world. Yellows are worth 1,000. 3,500. There's a chance Wynn may want to stick around. Now that there's two aces out there, you start to feel a little bit better about your tens. Cool. Especially second spade there, you, you could give Doyle some kind of flush draw. Oh. oh, wow. Talk about turning the tables on Doyle check. Brunson. And a nice check. 
Doyle with just the three aces. Win. Rivers the boat. 12,000. Say goodbye to 12,000. And almost full pot. And I like this because he's got the best ace in his mind. He's thinking, I'm going to charge a weaker ace here and it's going to pay me off. May as well go full pot. Well, Doyle will be able to get away from the raise. Great. Raise. Right. 30,000. It's tough in Doyle's spot because okay. he just limped behind with yeah. ace-king, so he shouldn't have a hand as strong as ace-king here. <clears throat> yes, I think is Wynn going to raise on the river here with something like ace-queen or ace-jack? Interesting moment for Doyle Brunson. Can he get rid of this? It looks like he's going to. I think I'm going to have to. Who raises Doyle Brunson on the river without it? Was a check raise. Nice wow! Ooh, what a fold by Doyle Brunson. Show him. Respect your elders. Show him immediately. <laughs> Tabe Allen with King Queen. Uh, whiskey, honey, lemon. After you, you can Wallace put raised it, it with Ace Jack that. suited, Doyle Brunson with yeah, thank you. Queen and 10. Tea. It's like tea, wow. honey, lemon. See that our buddy Max have a small end, actually, 3,600. I like Tave's hopefulness, too. He's ordering a drink as he shoves all in with no fold equity. <laughs> Hope it's a really expensive one and celebrate whatever happens. He's had a good World Series, as mentioned, had a nice score. In the reunion, what this is, third yeah. place finish. Oh, a big event. No Thirteen thousand players. Okay. And, and now doing doing what he needs to do to hit this flop. Packing up. Even if you were to bust here, there's still post limbs. There's a, quite a bit of the schedule of WSOP after the main event. Mm -hmm. So no Lawless with the ace jack still to make oh. a decision here. But he does just call. We play it one all day. A lot of paint. There's eight, nine, jack, ten. <laughs> that is a straight. I see you counting on yeah, your fingers. Yep, that's a, a straight. Yeah, that's a straight, yeah. <laughs> Tave looking at this flop like, okay, this isn't so bad for me. Thinking that uh, he's Seven way more alive than he really is. He's drawing to a ten. Doyle sees the bet of 7,000 flopping the nuts. It should, it should turn around Doyle's post-dinner break slump. And it should. Plus he's up against top pair, top kicker. Right. There's no flush out there that could beat him. And when you're all in and you see a bet and a raise, <laughs> Such a sinking feeling. <laughs> oh, right? Yeah, especially when you see this flop and you think it's a good flop for your hand. Now he pretty much knows he's drawing to a 10. Um, Lola's with the ace jack suited here. I, I think this makes it a little bit of an easier fold that there's an all in player that has to show down for the main pot. There's not quite as much to fight over, and Doyle is more likely to have a very strong hand raising into a dry side pot. And now Lawless with top pair, top kicker. I wonder if he thinks he's got Doyle on the hook. Curious to know. Um, all in. He says all in. Oh, yeah, wow. he thinks he's got Doyle yeah, on the wow. hook. And Doyle snap calls with the maid straight. <laughs> and love the way he throws the cards in. I am Doyle Dan Brunson. Yeah, good flop. So it's actually Tave that, that has a little more equity 
going to the turn than Lawless does. The Doyle in line for a double knockout at our feature table. A king and Doyle Brunson has them both drawing dead. Still a chop possibility. Again. A river card? Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> no, no chop oh. Yet. Sit down, sir. Yep. Sit down, sir. Oh. Oh. Otave so packed up at just the right moment. Yeah. Lawless yeah. Yeah. is done. Doyle will get his chips. Tave will get a piece of the others, but Doyle will take the bulk of that pot. The whiskey is on the way, you can see it. Uh, we already won a guy. It's like Tave can't believe he's getting a piece of this pot. <laughs> he doesn't want to take his bag off. David Lawless knocked out flopping top pair of top kicker, but Doyle flopped the straight. He'll end up chopping a small portion of that pot as Tave was in for just 3,600. <laughs> oh. I bet Doyle Brunson knows how to play ace queen. I'd love for him just to pull out a copy of Super Systems and that go through the pages. <laughs> it's like Einstein didn't have to remember things because he wrote things down, he said. Hmm. Door wrote it all down. Did JJ Lou hit that flop? Is there a five there? Yes. Five more hands to play. About a week, you come back on 11 a.m. <laughs> ah, Doyle gets there so far, but two, four. Hearts and another wow. heart on the end, and J.J. Lou turns the tables on the flush maker Doyle Brunson. Oh, and he overbets the river. And a quick call. Was that a raise? Min raise, yep. Oh, min raise. He reached, he almost threw, he checks, he calls, he loses. Black again. 